Princess Anne snubbed significant Prince Harry event during full-scale family dispute. A major Prince Harry event was snubbed by Princess Anne during a full-scale family row. A full-scale family dispute led Princess Anne to snub a significant Prince Harry event. For the royal family, christenings are a joyous occasion. The public is then shown pictures from the momentous occasion as the family celebrates the official arrival of the newest member. However, the christening of Prince Harry was able to create a significant divide among firm members. One analyst reports that the 1984 event caused so many disputes that Princess Anne really declined to go. At the age of three months, Princess Diana and Prince Charles christened their second son at Windsor Castle in December. During the festivities, the Spencer family was joined by Prince Andrew, Prince Edward, the Queen, Prince Philip, and the Queen Mother. However, following a full-scale family row, Anne chose to go shooting with her then-husband Mark Phillips. Unfortunately, neither of them could make it, said a statement issued by Buckingham Palace at the time. They are scheduled to arrive in Windsor later today. Yet, according to royal writer Ashley Walton, Anne declined to go as she had been passed up for the role of godmother for the second time. She claimed, when she found out that her younger brother, Andrew, would be the godfather of three-month-old Prince Harry, she became extremely upset and the argument escalated into a full-fledged family dispute. With confidence, the royal family anticipated Anne and Mark's arrival for yesterday's ceremony at 11 a.m. However, the cannons at Gatcombe Park, 100 miles distant, were blazing as the infant was being baptized. Rumor has it that Prince Philip was also irritated by the choice and wasn't talking to his son Charles when he was christened. In lieu of Anne, Diana and Charles selected Prince Andrew, Lady Sarah Chado, Princess Margaret's daughter, Diana's friend and former roommate, Carolyn Bartholomew, Gerald Ward, and Celia, Lady Vesti, who are also close friends of the Prince of Wales, as godparents. Harry has now served as a godfather numerous times, notably to Lena Tyndall, Princess Anne's granddaughter. She was christened at said Nicholas Church in Charrington, Gloucestershire, and he was photographed there. Harry acknowledged practicing fatherhood with his godchildren in April 2017, prior to becoming a father himself. I'm a godfather to quite a few of my friends, kids, he explained. Um, actually only five or six. Growing up while maintaining the connection to your childhood side is crucial, he continued. I'll attempt to do that if it entails going to someone's house, sitting there, playing PlayStation, and kicking their son's ass on. To be honest, I've practiced a lot for that.